Disclaimer under Section 107 of the Copyright Act 1976, allowance is made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, scholarship, and research. Fair use is a use permitted by copyright statute that might otherwise be infringing. Nonprofit, educational, or personal use tips the balance in favor of fair use. Hey babes, I'm back with another video. <laughs> and today we you know we talk about uh, Miss Peaches. Miss Peaches. Girl, you can take the girl out the ghetto, but you can't take the ghetto out the girl. Like, you is so ghetto. It's ridiculous. Like, then you get on here talking about attention girl they put the food stamps <laughs> they don't drop the food stamps if you in florida they don't drop the food stamps on the car i bet your car full i bet your car is full like it's ridiculous like how in the world you a big bag big bang and you worrying about food stamps and then you was talking about food stamps the day before they even dropped the food stamps you was worrying about if they were gonna release food stamps early like millionaires don't worry about food stamps millionaires don't flaunt their money their wealth they might have a nice car or a nice home or whatever but they be they dress normal they don't want people to know that they millionaires that's the point of having money to be conspicuous with it it's just dumb like and then you sit here and walk around walmart <laughs> with your hair standing on top of your dang on head like a troll doll and then you gonna the, them people in line who the fuck gonna listen to you the line the line is, is, is long, cheaper than now you can go down there and check out real fast girl ain't nobody gonna listen to you and take no advice from you there people looking at you like she lying. You, she look like a liar. Cause trolls lie. And everything you do, this how we do it in Florida. This how it's done in Florida. Girl, stop lying, making them people in Florida look bad. I got plenty of family down there in Florida, and they don't do nothing that you do. I mean, you make Florida look bad. It's crazy that when you not with Wood, he managed to get up and get his day started quite early. Like he managed to get to the tire shop and get the Popeyes for lunch, across the street from the casino. And then he showed us, oh, he finna go to the casino and, and scratch his little itch or whatever with the money that you gave him. How much money did you give him? Like you are a complete and utter fool. They say, why do fools fall in love? Baby, he got you wrapped around his finger because you had to give him some thousands of dollars because <laughs> it sure wasn't no hundreds. It's crazy. You out here trying to get ready for a hurricane that's coming to Tampa and he out here making it rain in the casino with the money that you gave him. That is ridiculous. That is ridiculous. My thing is, I don't even think we'll post that picture or that video i think you did because when wood posts on his um pages it be the word and be all over the place and sometimes he don't even put no word in there when you post on his page it's all capital letters with emojis and stuff like that like make it make sense i think you still posting on his page and i don't think he at the house i think this is just a skit and then it's just a scam again I ain't trying to be funny or whatever, but I bet that damn teddy bear full of mold. They take that teddy bear to the beach, to the pool. That teddy bear be wet every day. And I never really see them washing or sanitizing that teddy bear. Like if they open that teddy bear up, it's probably full of mold. That cotton probably full of mold. They need to check that out because that boy love that bear. Like it's ridiculous. Then you take your kids you gotta go to walmart and go buy stuff you just wasteful 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 you gotta go and buy pampers and wipes and baby bags and all this stuff because you left at home you was that fascinated with getting rid of your kids 
that you had, you don't forgot the bags that you needed to pack to take in the daycare? Who in the fuck does that? You gonna take a child to daycare without the necessities that they need to stay there. They should have called you and told you to come get these kids and don't bring them back. Like, this is ridiculous. Then you gonna pick up an outfit <laughs> in the baby section that say, good boy. Come on, I ain't put my baby on that. I ain't put my baby on that. You should have said bad boy and you should have bought it for wood. Honey, this is ridiculous. <laughs> and then you love to say, oh, self-checkout for people that steal. The self checkout is for people that have things to do that don't mind and are not lazy and will check their own groceries out. Like you, your mindset is on some stupid shit. Like we know exactly what you used to do when you used to have your food stamps and you were in self checkout. You were there to uh, scan one, free the next, scan one, free the next. Like it's ridiculous. I never seen a grown person that say they don't watch the news. How in the world don't you watch the news? So you don't know what's going on in your area. It could be somebody outside doing a sh something crazy. And right outside your door, you wouldn't even know because you won't turn on the news. Like, this is ridiculous that you have to find out through social media. If you didn't, if this social media thing just pop off and go down for a week, two weeks, three weeks, a month, you would be seriously lost. But I bet you, if Wood, Woody Wood was on the news every day, baby, that would be your favorite TV show and you would be there without, with bells and whistles, bells and whistles on, bells and whistles. Now you so heartbroken and all this stuff because you ain't with wood and you got to deal with your kids on a daily basis that he ain't got to be Mr. Mom no more. So now you just so heartbroken. Who gets mad that they got to deal with their kids and not deal with, it's like he deal with the kids every day and you deal with them when you want to deal with them. You always have a camera in their face. So you're dealing with them for content. Like, it's ridiculous. Then you sitting inside the car. At least the baby not wrapped around your neck was damn. You could have at least had him quiet before you picked up that camera. Put your camera down. Pick and, and pay attention to your child. He ain't got to be wrapped around your neck. But you could have put a pacifier or something in his mouth. That baby screaming to the top of his lungs. For what reason? This is ridiculous. And you're talking about child support. You already had him on child support, and you took him off child support. This is ridiculous. So now you mad and want to put him on child support, but you see what kind of parent he was to the, to the other first, first kids he had, the older kids. So what make you so special? What make your kids so special that he wasn't going to do the same thing to them? You don't like them kids. You didn't want him around them kids. And them wood kids, I don't got nothing to do with them. Okay, now he's showing you exactly, if I'm not with the mom, the hell with the kids. He doing you the same way he did the other baby mamas. And now you are just that, a baby mama. But this is just a crock of shit. So, we already know he back home. Y'all finna be up in Tampa. And the hurricane winds blowing outside and y'all cracking crab legs in the inside. Girl, bye. Anyways. Y'all like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that bell notification so y'all know every time I drop a banger. And, um, yeah, drop some comments below of channels y'all want me to review. And I'll do that for you. Until next time, see you later, babes. Deuces.